What are the best skirts for short women? Skirts can look very different on a model or a mannequin versus on someone who is petite. And the reason is we have different body proportion compared with taller girls. So the best skirts for short women should focus on three things. We wanted to create the illusion of height, improve our body proportion to make us look longer and leaner. So what kind of skirt can accomplish the goals? In order to understand what are the best skirts for short girls, let's first look at how the skirts are constructed. First, the rise of the skirt. The most easy way to understand the rise of the skirt is to see how high it sits on your waist. Like this one, if it sits above your belly button, then it's a high rise. If the skirt is hanging on your hips, a couple of inches below your belly button, then that is low rise. There are many skirts that sit between the high rise and the low rise, the mid rise skirts. The most flattering for petite women are the high rise skirts. The reason is the high rise skirts sit higher than your natural waistline. Each of us is born with our natural waist. The higher your waistline is, the longer your legs look. Even though we cannot change where our natural waistline sits, we can change the perceived waistline. That is, when someone else looks at us, where do they see the waistline is? When you wear a high-waisted skirt, your waistline is elevated. That makes your legs look longer and your torso look shorter. That's why high-rise skirts is the best choice for petite women. Now let's look at the silhouette of the skirts. There are many different skirt silhouettes. In order to choose the most flattering skirts for short women, you need to first understand your body type and find the skirts for your shape. Now let me go over with you the most common skirt shapes you will find in the stores. A line flares out like a letter A. The pencil skirt is narrowly fitted hugs your body up and down like a pencil shape. The mermaid typically is longer. It's narrowly fitted from your hips to your thighs and flares up. A pleated skirt is fitted at the waist and it flares out with many folds, narrow or wide. Now the bias cut. It's cut on the 45 degree angle on the fabrics rather than following the straight line of the weave. For short girls, I generally recommend the A-line shape. The A-line skirts are the most universally flattering. No matter what your height, your body type, and your age group, the A-line skirts always works. The mermaid shape works the best on those who have natural curves, or if you want to create the illusion of curves. The pencil skirts are cut very narrowly, and many of them cling to your thighs. Because they highlight the curves of your lower body, if you are the pear shape with a prominent thighs and butt, when you wear a pencil skirt, that becomes more obvious. So it's up to you if you want to show that. Next, the pleated skirts. If you are petite, you want to make sure you go with those. The folds are not too wide or too many because you don't want to have too much volume to overwhelm your frame. I want to talk about is a bias cut. The bias cut is super on trend and you see it pretty much everywhere. The bias cut is supposed to be flattering because it's cut on an angle, the 45 degree versus a straight line. But I have to caution you, if you have a belly, the bias cut will make that more noticeable. If you're certain body types such as the pear shape, the bias cut is going to hug your hips and your thighs in a way that's going to make them very noticeable. If you're self-conscious about your prominent thighs or your hips, I do not recommend you wear the bias cut. I will make another video how to choose the best silhouettes based on your body shape. Leave me a comment below if you are interested in that. Now let's look at the designs of the skirts. And the design can make a huge difference. Asymmetrical hem is a very flattering design for short women. This could be asymmetrical hem or it could be the high-low hem. This kind of design tricks the eyes to believe our legs are longer. That's why they're super flattering for someone with short legs. Any skirts with a side slit or a front slit are also very flattering for short women. When you move, the slit is going to show some of your skin. 
That is especially very flattering if you are wearing longer skirts, because now you don't look like you are swamped in the fabrics. Now let's look at the length of the skirts. The mini skirts are one of the best skirts for short girls, because when you are showing more of your legs, that's when your legs will look longer. If you want your skirt to be longer than the mini skirts, then you can go up to your knee length. That can still be flattering for short women. What about the maxi skirts? Many women didn't know that they are super flattering for petite women as well. The reason is the maxi skirts are so long, it forms an unbroken vertical line, and that is the most flattering element that every petite woman needs. So if you've never tried maxi skirts because you think that it's for taller girls, I highly suggest that you try them out, and you will be very surprised by what you find out. When you're wearing maxi skirts, the best way to make them flatter a short girl is to pair it with a crop top. Double the effect of leg elongating because the crop top will make your torso look shorter. Combined with the maxi skirts, that's gonna look super flattering on a petite woman. What about the midi skirts? A super on trend. I have to say that midi skirts is not the most flattering length for petite women because the length of the skirts is a little awkward. It is not long enough to create the vertical line like the maxi skirts, and it's not short enough to show off your legs, make your legs appear longer. I do understand a lot of times you want to wear midi skirts. Some of the occasions you go to, it's more formal. Or if you are in the office, you don't want a shorter skirt. Perhaps you prefer to wear midi length. How to make midi length flattering on petite women? I have another video, and I highly recommend you watch this video on how to make a midi length look good if you are petite.